Hello friends, welcome back to your channel Test to Technology. Today I'm going to show how to install child domain controller. So friends, in my previous video, we have configured primary domain controller and additional domain controller. You may check out from the playlist and also you can browse it. So friends, a child domain is a subdomain of one of the component domain in your Active Directory forest. Subdomain segmentations allow the logical partition of your Active Directory and also enforce the right delegation to your child. So friends, today's task is step by step. Configure a static IP address, rename computer name and domain joining, installation Active Directory, domain services rules, from the server manager, promote your server as a child domain controller and finally verify the child domain controller. So friend, I'm going to our workstation for a start this demonstration. So friends, I am in our lab environment. So I just unlock this server. So friend, we have taken new server without any roles and features. So friend, I am using a static IP address. So I just configure the first of all a static IP address and cpa.cpl I am going to network place. Oops. And cpa.cpl Okay, click on do not show this message. Okay. So IPv, we are using IPv4 protocol. So I am using 192.168.184.111. Subnet marks 255.255.255.0. Gateway 192.168.184.1. DNS 192.168. 184.100 alternate DNS is 192.168.184.102 okay so now he is identifying this network okay so I just verify being the default gateway 192.168.184.1 Okay, friends, I am now able to ping this gateway. Close this window. Close. So, I think some services is not running. So, first of all, we start the services. Okay, right click. Start service. Okay. Okay, click on refresh. So, starting services. Don't worry, friends. So friend, second task, you rename the server. So I am in server manager, click on local server, click in work group. So here is showing system properties. Under this computer name, you can click on change. So I am using domain controller, CDDC 2022. Okay. And putting the domain name in my case test to technology dot local click on OK so friend here is asking domain credential I'm using administrator Okay, here is showing welcome to test to technology dot local domain. Click on OK. Okay, friends, here is showing you must restart this computer to apply these settings. Click on OK. Close this window. Restart now. Okay, 
click to unlock the system okay other users so friends i am using domain credential Okay friends, now I am in server manager, click on add rules and features, click on next, select first option role based and feature based installation, click on next, okay, again you can select first option, select a server from the server pool, this child domain, domain controller 2022, click on next, okay, so friend you can select the active directory domain services add features click on next leave it default click on next next okay click on install so it will take few minutes to finalize this installation process So friend, installation process is done. Now you can close this window. Okay, after that you can click on notification area. See friend, here is showing promote the server to a domain controller. Click on that. So friend, here is three option. So I am just select the second option. Add a new domain. To an existing forest okay so my child domain name is Bukaro click on next so friend here is asking directory services restore mode password so I just simply enter the password and confirm the password. Okay, then you can click on next. Okay, leave it default. Click on next. So verifying the net bias. So in my case, that is Bukaro. Okay, click on next. Okay, so friend here is showing the default location of your database, logs or syswall folder. If you need, you can change from click on here. So in my case, leave it default, click on next. Okay, click on next. So friends, here is verifying the prerequisite check. So OK is passed successfully, click on installed. So friend, it will take few times to finalize this installation. So friend, installation is done successfully. So here is showing one pop-up message. You are about to sign out. Click on close. So server is now restart. So friend is applying the computer settings. So friends, okay, I'm just click on uh, log the server.
So friends, it's a time to verify our child domain controller. So I just click on tools. So after that, you can click on Active Directory, Users and Computers. See friends, here is showing Bukaru dot test to technology dot local so under this users i just create one user right click new user touch to technology copy and paste click on next okay and check ghs I am putting the password. Okay. Okay, friends, you can also verify this child domain controller from your primary domain controller. So I am going back to our primary domain controller. Okay, click on tools. Active directory, users and computers. See friends, here is showing our primary domain controller, touch to technology dot local, right click, change domain, my child domain name is Bukaro, click OK. So now I am able to connect our child domain controller. So earlier we have created one user, so I just check and verify, click on users. See friend here is showing test to technology. So thank you. Thank you for watching this video. Hope you like all the videos and please subscribe the channel and click on the bell icon for new update.